Governor Andy Bashir is talking with lawmakers about a possible special session to deal with the COVID-19 surge, and it could come soon. WDRB's Lauren Smith explains why the governor and state lawmakers are now trying to work together to fight the virus. Here at the Capitol, talks between the governor and leaders of the General Assembly could lead to a special session on the COVID crisis within the next couple of weeks. For more than a year, Republicans in the legislature have been stewing on the sidelines as Governor Andy Bashir battled COVID by executive action, ordering mask mandates, business closures, and other measures to try and control the virus. But last week, the state Supreme Court changed that, limiting the governor's emergency powers. Now, a lot of those decisions are going to have to be made by the General Assembly. Governor Andy Bashir telling WDRB News the General Assembly will now have to step up. So there are things that I can do on an everyday basis, but but listen, it's getting really bad. And so if we need to go back to, to masking, for instance, um, on a wider basis, that's going to have to be the General Assembly. I don't think a universal mandate uh, would pass uh, the legislature. House Speaker David Osborne says there will be no mask or vaccine mandates, but he says lawmakers are in talks with the administration on more targeted measures. Trying not to make um, one-size-fits-all policies, trying not to, uh, to make policy without considering how it affects individual school districts, how it affects individual families, how it affects uh, individual businesses. But the Senate's top Democrat hopes whatever lawmakers do will not be too little too late. People are dying now. Our ICUs are filling up now. Our children's ICUs are filling up now. We need to take action, not just play politics. I think that within uh, the next few days, we will have something that, that we will have consensus around and ready to pass. The governor says only he is having constructive conversations with lawmakers, but has given no timetable yet as to when he might call them back to Frankfurt. At the state capitol, Lawrence Smith, WDRB News.